are my witnesses. That, friends, is the theme for General Synod 2016, and it is a magnificent theme. It's deeply rooted in the scriptures. We borrow it actually from Isaiah chapter 43. Where Isaiah is speaking to the people of Israel a word of hope and promise, a word of return and restoration. As we know, Jesus picks up the same image when at the end of the gospel, he's sending his disciples into all the world with the message of the gospel, the fullness of the gospel. We Anglicans talk about the fullness of the gospel, proclaiming good news, nurturing people in faith, helping people that are in need, trying to build a just world and caring for the earth. You are my witnesses. It's a beautiful theme. It has for me about it the ring of call and command. It has about it for me the ring of invitation and instruction. It has about it for me the ring of responsibility and the weight that comes upon us with responsibility as members of General Synod, who are there to care for the life of our church national and its place within the Anglican Communion and with all our other ecumenical brothers and sisters. You are my witnesses. It is a beautiful theme. It's a challenging theme because it speaks to me of the manner in which we're called to go about our work in Synod. You and I know that some of our work in Synod is just an absolute joy and delight. And some of it is challenging and it's a struggle. But this theme, You Are My Witnesses, speaks into, I think, the manner in which God asks us to go about our work in ways that are respectful, in ways that are prayerful. And one of the great consolations for me going into not just this synod, but any synod, is that the members are always upheld by the prayers of the whole church. I have to tell you that when the theme for this synod emerged and the logo I was completely taken with the place of the cross in the theme. It actually reminds me of the piece of Palm Cross that we receive on Palm Sunday. And, and I have always loved that piece of Palm I get on Palm Sunday because it's, it's green, it's, it's lush, and there's a scent of freshness about it. But I also know, and you do too, that unless that piece of palm is kept in water, it will dry up, it will become brittle, and it may well break. So the place of the cross in this theme, You Are My Witnesses, speaks to me of our relationships, our relationships with our Lord, and our relationships with one another. And it calls me to be very prayerful that in our work in Synod, we in fact will be attentive to our relationships. No doubt in this Synod, there will be some stress and some strain. But I hope and pray that in the grace of the waters of baptism, in which we've been made one with Christ, that we'll be able to continue to do our work in Synod, and that we'll know that in the midst of it all, we are, in fact, members one of another. To use Johannine language, we are friends in Christ. To use the language of Paul, we're partners in God's mission. You are my witnesses. That's the theme of General Synod 2016. And I hope that in and through this Synod, the
the way in which we are engaged in our work will be a beautiful reflection of it. May it be the theme, not only in Synod, but through Synod, and through the next triennium, until we meet again in 2019.